plays Yoshi in Smash. He does. Just like Lucius. Yeah, that's. I was going to mention that when we were talking about Lucius, but mm -hmm. I was like, wait, Sorry, okay, mod, because it's kind of funny yeah. coincidence. I think he's pretty good, too. Also, uh, his fundamentals carrying over, like we said. So he is, uh, so if you guys haven't seen Zaro since we did have a stream for Top 32 at SmashCon, but this is going to be a treat. Mm -hmm. He's an awesome Orcane. He is uh, as fun to watch as Dolphin Brick to me, honestly. Mm -hmm. He's great. This is going to be the ultimate test for him, <laughs> playing against number one in the world. So, yeah. And the thing the thing that gets me about Cake Assault is, like, it, I, his technical prowess is extremely obvious when you watch him play, right? Mm -hmm. But the thing that was getting me, I, I played a bunch of friendlies with him after the bra uh, bracket yesterday as well. And the dude's situational knowledge is absurd. Like, the, the amount of grinding that he obviously does is so apparent when you hear him talk about the game. It's like, he kills you for something, he's like, oh yeah, we lab that out with uh, ZB and all this kind of stuff. And it's like, <laughs> it has like four names for different techs that I've never even seen happen in my life. And it's yeah. just like, all right, all right, you got it, you got it, dude. <laughs> but hey, that's Zero taking this first stock here. Yeah, getting him with that nice up air from Arcane. Okay. Arcane's got a couple of d deadly moves like that. Very All strong right. kill power for a very small whale dog. Yeah, definitely. Or cat. The range here, I would assume, is a big problem for Arcane. Uh, the, the range that Forsburn has with the cape and the dagger. Yeah. I'm trying to think of uh, some pass matches we've seen with mm -hmm. Cake versus uh, Orcane. This, this happens yeah. a lot, yeah. I don't think Cake is a huge uh, like cape user, mm -hmm. but it's a great tool in his kit. OK. Got the smoke coming out. Man, this is dominant right now from Zaro. Some these are three stocks for one. And in them early. Look, anybody anybody who's watched Cake at recent events knows better than to count him out right now. <laughs> oh yeah. But <laughs> this is, is game one, Cake. Come back you from know? many a uh, <laughs> deficit <laughs> to win many an event. <laughs> Absolutely. Here we go. Zaro with the parry. This is a great start to his uh, big house debut. Man, his juggle game is incredible. Let's go, Zaro. Okay, the forward smash does catch from all the way back there. Smacked in the face by his own. Uh, okay, great I would say parry. actually great that it, the puddle, the puddle bounced back at him, it saved him from a follow up, but not that time. That that puddle drop is such a great timing mix up on the parry though. That was so smart of Cake to know. Okay, that's coming. Now you're gonna back her. Now I'm gonna press parry. Ooh, I actually really like seeing the up smash at Orkane there. Mm. People don't use it enough because it's oh, hard. The spike? <laughs> what? He was trying to hit it with the up one for sure. Yeah, I mean either hitbox was gonna kill. So. Right, right. Well, no, I don't know if the down one had to kill him at all. That's true. If he was diing in, he probably could attack the the stage. You're right. You're right. Yeah. I think he even could have di out there and lived like he would have went into the corner and been oh, okay. Sure, sure, sure. So that was just a funny awkward, kill. Awkward. But awkward. awesome, awesome. Like yeah. Zara gave one. Look at him. <laughs> He's just like. Yeah, uh, I, just sure. took, I just took a game from the best player in the world. Yeah, you know, you know. the office, you know. But uh, yeah, like I said, more, he's though. dominating these players online. Yeah, just never offline. No, he's, he's a, not able to come out. So he's yeah. a mainstay in the top eight of the, the RCS majors when yeah. uh, when those are going on. I, he so. made the top fifty last season exclusively from online, and so like and that did not happen for RCS people. events. No, it's so two or three people. Yeah. yeah. Because we had a hard but, focus on offline man, events. But yeah, you, you can't deny this dude's skill. Yeah, exactly. And we got a switch here. Okay. And here he is showing up. Cake Assault Zetterburn, and this was uh, this was the character that I first got to know him playing. Okay, but uh, actually, the first person that I ever played local friendlies with, I sat down in a setup. I didn't know who Cake Assault was at G4. Right, <laughs> and then I I did not hit him. No, honestly, <laughs> G4 was so fun for that exact reason. That was kind of one of our. It wasn't like our inaugural event, but it was like the for biggest, a lot of people. Was, yeah, yeah, the biggest like community event for that season one. So, Absolutely. Yeah. So many people for the first time. I remember uh, like. All these money matches Ooh. with people. You're like, who is this? Oh, this is like Forrest. Just destroying <laughs> me. Okay, okay, okay. Good stalls here from Zaro, holding on to the stock. I like these bounces from way up high. Isn't mm -hmm. that first game too, bouncing off that platform? Oh yeah, the nair bounce, absolutely. Yeah. Jab F tilt, huh? Okay, good aggressive downer from Cake Assault, blowing that up, but the down strong. Yeah. Even he with the nerf, frame seven, that, man. That tech, I'm surprised. Zaro went right into the platform, checked, and then just able to sneak away. Mm -hmm. Oh, the fall off. I don't know if he wanted that. And this juggle. Here goes the damage. Uh, I don't think Zaro was expecting him to go straight to the ledge there. Yeah. Forward tilt, no. Not unless there was some atrocious DI. Great movement there with the bubbles. <laughs> and how is Zaro still alive? Yeah, this, that. this is like the point of switching to Zetterburn. Yeah. Okay, the forward air will take it. You want to kill him not at 200% nope. when you have Zetterburn. Mm -hmm. You want to kill him at 90%. Look at the struggle. Ooh. And now every hit that Arcane gets is terrifying because the wrong DI and you're just, you're getting up smashed and you're dying. Yeah. Man, this puddle placement reminds me of Ralph back in the day. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Again, yep. twice in a row. 
no threat for his recovery. Another shout out to G4, man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> bring it back today. But honestly, uh, that's a little different strong, playstyle yeah. thing. You see, uh, okay, that hitbox lingering. Cake Salt down here again in game two. Yeah, like I said, that up smash is incredibly powerful. Mm. One of the better moves in the game. It's just so uh, very narrow compared to like a lot of Arcane's other options. Yep. So it's not used so much. What's the puddle though? It looks like that lingered quite a bit. Yeah, it looks safe. Okay, yep. there we go. There's that Zed of Burn uh, power. Yeah, cake right back in this. Yeah. Don't walk into that fire. Oh. No, he still does. Mm -hmm. He has to keep the pressure up. Bubble butt, no, not gonna kill. Able to get back on stage and uh oh, this put is the, the worst resetter. On. That Somehow, was a yeah. really smart upbeat placement though. Yeah. Already rolling in after Cake destroys that puddle. Alright, yeah. Critical edge guard moment here. The bubbles. And oh, the down strong catches yeah. the he was trying to get to the floor, probably bounce and use that little cancel there. That's great timing though. Mm -hmm. It's a little, it's deceptive. It's easy to get hit by that. Yep. Really smart by Zara, though. I'm just going to fill the space. I know you have to go here, or you're going to do something really crazy, like going high. Even if you really don't want to do that. Yeah, if you went game. high, he would just follow up, like an up air, still yep. high percent. Exactly. And you're, like you said, if you went, uh, even if you went forward, I think, like, that stays out long enough, that down smash from Arcane, that he would run into it. And Absolutely, yeah. Yeah, you're done. Great coverage. So, 2 0. 2 0 for Zara. All, All right. right. Yeah, are we going to see another game as Zetter, do you think? That's hard to say, honestly. I think it went better than the fours, but I do think that fours is still Cake's best character. Yeah. So. Cake is definitely quick to switch. Um, Back to fours. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if what he's like warmed up for today. Ooh. Here we go, Zetter see on uh, Cake's counter pick, though, again. This is uh, much bigger. Okay. Oh, yeah, and the platform movements from Cake on this stage. Oh, yeah. It's so scary. I love seeing him on, like, here, uh, Fire Capital. When he has those platforms going oh, up in great the DI. ladder, so terrifying. Yeah, if Cake had uh, done the thing that scared people like me would have done and held in on that backer, he was oh, dead. No! Oh, but he died okay. anyway. At first, I thought, I thought, good job, he didn't DI in, uh, dive top early, but he went in too far into the corner. I was going to say, I do think this is a great stage for Orkane because of the fairly low ceiling. Right. And especially, like, being able to use those higher platforms to set up for his up air. Yeah. Uh, but Cake's, like I said, Cake's platform movement, I get why he did this. Okay, dash Because he carries people off the top, too. Yes. So that's, you know, both ways. And he just... Oh, interesting. Yeah. Up cape. Not able to follow up with that. Okay. Man, I wonder... Zara's just so fast. Yeah, I was trying to... Exactly just the same thing as you. Pinpoint why it looks like Cake's having so much trouble here. Cake is normally the fastest player. Mm. Damn, Zara just can't... Zar just can't be hit right now. At least not by the important things. He you looks know? like he's outranging him a lot too. Which, yeah. Like we mentioned, uh Ooh, okay. one's got that cape and the down tilt and stuff. So it's interesting. I think Zaro guessed wrong on the clone there. Yeah. Very easy to do, especially against Cake, who's so good at <laughs> keeping your attention on the wrong spot, right? Yeah. And that that's one of the things that makes Forsburn such a cool character in my opinion. One right? of my favorite mechanics. Yeah. It's so cool. It's so hard to make a stealth character in a fighting game. You know? You're yeah. supposed to be fighting. <laughs> It's but hard yeah. to balance, but I think nah, it came you guys out did cool. A, you guys did an amazing job with it. Yeah, there's a down strong. There we go. Yeah, Another that's, big lead for Zaro. That's kind of free for Orkane, honestly. Winner's stock right now, man. Yeah. Down tilts. Yeah, okay. And this is not particularly close to death from what we've been seeing for Zaro. No. no. It's been uh, like Kate can do it. these stocks. We've seen him get uh, crazy stuff like cloned to down air to, to kill extremely early, but he's just not getting any of these situations. Here we go. Down strong. Great, Great DI. DI. Are you yes. kidding me? <laughs> the parry. Oh. He was too far away. Yeah, he didn't even get to the wall to wall jump yeah. out of the free fall. Okay, he this could have come back. Yeah. And he's got, uh, he's got full combust charge. It's going to be a little early to use it. Mm -hmm. We'll see if he racks up damage with it. It's good to hold on this to it is, anyway. This is already terrifying because if yeah. you get the right combo starter, I this think could be cool. A combo here, like out of this middle platform, could even kill oh, Zaro. Careful, at careful. Like 60%. <gasps> That's it. 3 0. Oh, <laughs> okay. This tournament just got really interesting. All right, we see uh, in the crowd back there. That's Mr. Mutton, uh, Zaro's brother, clapping for him. All right, <laughs> awesome, man. That's so cool. I'm not sure if he's a new player or not, but I know uh, I don't think he has a lot of tournament results. Yeah, we we're talking about him in the seeding group, like oh, uh, sure. Menace and Sparks and them. Look, look, look. How good many times him? this season though have we seen Cake fall to losers just to make a huge run to get back? You know, that's a good question. It's been it's been quite a few, and I wish like, I had an answer. Like Cake, <laughs> Cake has been far from invincible as number one, right? The thing is, t to me, that uh, he falls to losers only from one person basically, and that's Penguin. 
Hanging well, he lost his Windows CDA glitch. Season. Yeah, okay, a glitch. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Bagel got him once, right? At uh, Smash and Splash. Not that was, this, not that this was last year, season, right? but yeah, yeah, that was last year. But yeah. Yeah, so like. Yeah. He, uh, he's he's uh, terror in the loser's bracket, yeah. honestly. 